Hey guys, welcome to Protocol Dash Point. Okay, so in this Flutter tutorial, we're gonna learn how to change the app icon of your Flutter app in Android and iOS platforms. Okay, so let's begin. So here, as you can see, I have an app with an app logo. That is our logo. That is Protocol Dash Point dot com. Okay, so let's learn how to do it. So let's go to our Android Studio. Okay, so here I have created a simple app and named it as Launcher Icon. And for now, it simply have a default code given by Flutter team. Okay, so let's begin. Okay, so let's check the default logo given by Flutter while creating new Flutter project. So just go to Android App Sources Main Resources and in the mid map, so you can see there is the IC Launcher. So this is the Flutter logo given by Flutter while creating new Flutter project. So you can just change this logo with your app logo that you want to set as a launcher icon. Okay, so you can just manually do it by copy pasting and updated images of your company logo or something. You can just paste it over here and in Android manifest here app icon you can just change the path of your latest icon that you have copied over here. So this is the manual process of doing this. So in this video tutorial, we are going to check out how to do it by automatically by making use of Flutter library called as Flutter launcher icon. So let's do it. So first of all, just create a new directory over here and let's create a directory as assets and under assets directory, we will create one more directory and name it as icon. And under this icon, we will just copy a image or a logo inside this icon folder. So just copy it and name it as logo.png or you can name anything. Okay. So after creating a directory and copy pasting a image image over in this directory. So just go to pop specification.yaml file. So over here you have a section called as a uh, due dependency and under that you just need to add a dependency called as flutter launcher icon launcher icon so just add this dependency and hit this pub get button okay so after that you will just see a code that is zero it means the flutter library has been added successfully so after that you just need to define a path of this directories of your logo under pub specification.yaml file and for that here flutter icons and uh, here there are three properties that you need to pass that is android ios and image path so let's do it so here android make it true ios make it true and image underscore path And in this path, you just need to set uh, pass this path that is assets icon and your image. So let's do it. Assets icon and the logo dot png. Okay. So here, uh, this Android true means uh, this icon should get generated in Android folder and also in ios folder so you can just keep it false if you don't want to generate for ios or android so you can just set it to false if you don't want uh, to generate a image logo for android so i will just make it true okay because i want uh, for both the devices for android and ios platform so after adding this code just hit this pub get button again Okay, so you can see the success code is zero. Uh, so after adding this library and giving this path, the definition, so you just go, go to terminal and un inside this, uh, once again, you can just uh, hit run this command if you need. Uh, this is same as pressing on this button. So I'm not going to do this. Okay, so now you just need to run a command that is uh, flutter pub run flutter launcher icons main okay so this is the command that will generate a icon by making use of this image so let's check it so for now our image is okay 
this logo okay so now after i press uh, after i run this command so you can see it is getting run so let's wait okay so you can see uh, icon has been created for android and also for ios devices so let's check the path again so now if i open this image again so old uh, default icon got replaced with our logo in our android folder as you can see with different sizes it get automatically uh, compress the image with with its pixel size so you can see 9 96 by 96 okay so this is the android part the app got generated so if we go to ios folder runner assets and over here also the same thing so our app icon got also changed in ios devices okay so let's run this project again and let's check the icon if it if it is reflecting in our app okay so app got installed on my device so let's check the app icon the app name is launcher icon so let's find it so you can see the app icon got changed with our defined as we defined okay so that's all for this video tutorial hope you got the concept so if you want the source code of this by step by step guide you can just visit my website protocoderspoint.com so here i have wrote an article on that how to do it that is a step by step process you can just refer you can just get the code this course and the command if you need okay so that's all for this video tutorial uh, please do subscribe protocoders point thank you